you guys it's Antoinette and I know it's been a while I've just been pretty lazy to do any videos even though I've shot I haven't stopped shopping at all I just stopped doing videos it's because I've been lazy and also because I went to wait until I get a new camera and I was gonna get it this week but I'm still deciding on what camera I should get I want the Canon SD 1400 or whatever it was and like a pink or the gold one but I'm it's like a lot of mixed reviews on it so I'm just gonna have to go to a store instead instead of ordering it online to figure out what I'm gonna get. So yeah, I just wanted to show like a couple things I recently got. Like this is just like some of the beauty stuff that I got lately. Um, most of it's not with me. I'm at my dorm right now, so most of my stuff is at home. So I just want to show like a couple of things that I got recently. And um, the first thing, like my mom got this for me. I didn't get to show it before, but. I love it. It's like the Urban Decay um, NYC palette. And it is so adorable. Oh my god. This is my first Urban Decay palette or any Urban Decay product at all. Look how cute that is. Oh my god. I love NYC. I love my state. My city. Anyway. <laughs> okay. And these are all the colors. These are so, like, even though there's a lot of, like, different crazy colors like I feel like they're all pretty wearable like anybody can wear them like they're amazing and I this is my first time using Urban Decay eyeshadows and I think they're really good I like them the glittery ones are like certain ones like Uzi I'm not sure about because like the glitter fallout is like crazy like even um, Midnight Cowboy Rides Again it's pretty but the glitter is like crazy but I guess I can just cover that up. Um, this is the first time I used the Urban Decay po um, Eyeshadow Potion Primer. I don't know if I like it. I It works. It works really good because my eyeshadow lasts long. But sometimes when I... I don't know if it's because of too much one. I don't think I do, though. Um, I, I can start seeing creases when I have this one. And I, I want to get the... Uh, it's like the champagne finish one. I can't remember what it's called. I think it was... Is it Eden? No, it's not Eden. It's uh, Sin. I think it's Sin. I want to get Sin. That's one I like a lot. Um, I love the uh, eyeliner, the 24 7 eyeliner. That one's really nice. But right now, on my eyes, I have um, my whole lid. I have smog. And then in the corner right here, I put Perversion, which is the black color. Oh, you can't see. But smog and then perversion over here. And then on top of that, I put, on top of the per perversion, I put Psychedelic Sister. I put like a little bit and then I put it in my, in my crease. And then I put Rockstar over that to darken it even more. And then on top of that, on top of right here, when I center of my lid, I put Suspect. And then at the corners, I put Midnight Cowboy Rides again. So yeah, that's what I'm wearing, and I really like this palette a lot. I really want the Naked palette. I've been on the waiting list for God knows how long already. It's gonna take forever. I don't think I'm ever gonna get it, but anyway. And then on my eye, since I might as well continue with that, I'm using the Wet n Wild Gel Liner, which I also recently bought, and I really like it. I mean, I don't really like it. I've used the Better Gel Liner, but whatever. It's better than Liquid Liner. Any any gel liner is better than, better than liquid liner, even though sometimes I use it. I'm not a big fan of liquid liner, but I'll use it if I have to, and I have no other choice, but I prefer gel liners. They go on well. They last longer. They just look way better than liquid liners, and I feel like sometimes more dramatic. Like, they work pretty good for me. Whatever. They're, they're good. And then I usually use this brush, um, which is by Essence of Beauty. You get this at like CVS or some type of drugstore or whatever. And I use this part. It's really soft and it works pretty good. I don't use a brush of canvas because I don't like it. Um, I got these eyelashes today from, from CVS. And these are Elite eyelashes. And they're European hair. And it says it's 100% human hair or whatever. Whatever. I don't really care if it's human hair, real fake, whatever. It's just going on my eyelids for like a night or whatever. But I've been into um, these fake eyelashes a lot, a lot lately. I like them. And I think they're cute on 
So I'm, I'm gonna start buying a whole bunch more and like trying that out or whatever. <laughs> Sorry if my voice sounds weird, but I'm like, I have like a cold or whatever, I don't know. Um, I got this like two days ago. It's this EOS chopstick. And I got this also in the pink one. Don't know what happened to it. I I don't know. This little egg bowl thing went disappearing. I don't, I have no idea. I lose everything. But this one is tangerine. Look, it looks like it looks like a little tangerine too. Like I love this one. This one I like this one better than the other one. And it's just how cute is that? I've been showing this off to everybody. People think I'm weird, but this is this is too cute. I feel like putting it on, but I have like lipstick on right now. But this I love this. This is adorable. And it smells good too. It smells like tangerines. And um, this is 95% organic, which is a plus. Always a plus for the organic stuff. Some lipsticks. From CVS. Got this fifth Acu show going on from Maybelline. Now it's like a fuchsia color. Basically, it's fuchsia. Um, and that I have right here. And then this one by Revlon. Iced Amethyst. It's like a purplish. Mixed with like pink. It's like a pearl finish. And this one is right here. And then this one from Revlon also. This is True Red, and this is like probably one of my new favorite reds. And this is like some red particular right there. And that one is right there, over there. Um, this one, when I first put it on, I was so feeling myself. I was just like, oh my god, I could not stop staring in the mirror. You can ask my roommate. I was just like, oh my god, this lipstick looks amazing on me. But, <laughs> let me stop. But it's really, I really like it a lot. It doesn't have white, a weird smell either. Like a lot of, um, lipsticks usually do. Besides the MAC ones. I got this lip gloss. I only have one of them on me. I bought three of them. And this is by Milani. And it's Leading Lady. And this is like a very thick lip gloss. Like sticky. Not like sticky, but so thick. It's practically like liquid lipstick. Like look at it. It's very glittery too. I think it's because of the glitter that makes it so thick. It's that one right there at the top. The very glittery one. But um, I bought two other ones, so I'll probably show that in a different video since I don't have them on me. But um, I like it. Nothing special. I'm not a big lip, a lip gloss person. But um, yeah. Speaking of lip glosses, I bought these yesterday. <laughs> I'm not a big lip gloss person, but I bought these. They were a doll or whatever. Um, these are by Elf. I got them from Target. And I got one more, but I don't have it on me. So the first one I have is Fairy. And it's like a very shimmery, pinky, champagne color. Um, light, very light. And I really like that one too. It looks so good on. It's my favorite one that I got. The next one I got is Flirt. It went so well on my, with my lips. I mean, I don't really see it. But I'm just going to wear these over some lipsticks. And then this one is a luscious liquid lipstick. And this one is Brownie Points. I like this one. And I also got baby something. I can't remember what it's called. I lost that one too. I have no idea where it is. I can't. I, I don't remember. Whatever. And then I also got this e.l.f. liquid liner. Speaking of, I don't like liquid liners, but I got it just because it's a dollar. I have a shopping problem. I'll get something because it's cheap. Just because. Or if it's on sale, I'll get it. Even though I probably won't ever use it. And these I got a while back. 
I just never got to show them. These are these the equal to eye shadow brushes. So these are all for your eyes. And I love these. These are so soft and good. This first one is a blender brush. You know, I just use it as for my whole lid to apply the whole the eyeshadow my eyeshadow to my whole lid. Um this one is a crease crease brush and then this one is the highlighter brush I use this one in my crease a lot too this one is the blender brush and this last one is the smudge brush and I use this one a lot for the my tear ducts when I need tear ducts whatever to so apply the eyeshadow there and it comes in this little cute pouch and has a mirror too so you can apply your eyeshadow and go just cute look good to go I like little tiny um what was I gonna say cosmetic brushes like makeup brushes like I like small ones I don't know why I just think they're cute and I just like them and, and this one is eagle friendly and I love everything eagle friendly so yeah um three eyes I got these three lipsticks from MAC today. I got Cyber, which is this deep purple one. I love it. Like, oh my god. Amazing. It's almost like a black, but it's not black. It's deep purple right there. And I love this. This is going to be my substitute until I get my Violetta, which I really want so bad. Next one I got is Snob, which I see. I was afraid to get at first. I really like the color, but I wasn't sure if I looked like Tyrone Biggums wearing it. But it worked out, so I got it. And it's right here, and it's appearing lighter than it is, but it's like a little bit pinkier. So. And the last one is Girl About Town, which is what I'm wearing right now. And it's like a, a magenta pink color. It's like Barbie color, like a Malibu Barbie color, um, and this is an amplified thing. Amplified. The other tree was satin, and it's that one right there. That color is so pretty. That's my fit. The last two things in this show are these nail polish polishes or whatever. So this one is Commander in Chief. Um, and this is by Sally Hansen. And it's like a mauvey gray purple color. Lavender color. It's so pretty. Um, don't mind my nails. They are kind of a mess right now. Look at that little flower I drew. And access to this larger flower that I drew. On my nails with nail polish from American Apparel. <laughs> I was at work and I was bored. And I just randomly did it. Like nobody was coming in the store. I was just painting my nails. So anyway, back to the last thing. Um, my all-time favorite nail polish. Like, oh my god, I love this. Um, this is um only gold for me. T yeah, this is only gold for me. Like, and it's like giant glitter thingies, glitters. This is by OPI. I got it from Sephora. Oh my god, it's so amazing. I usually put this over like um, a gold nail polish that I have, and then I apply like two or three coats of this, and like my nails are blinging, like blinging. And I'm like, I have like bling on my nails, and I love it because it reminds me of mixed nails, and I really want to get mixed nails, but like I've used this only a couple times, and already it's like I'm like down for that. So I want to get another one. Oh, no, last thing. Oh, let me show you what my friend got. She got this lipstick, Viva Glam 1. It's a red lipstick, and it's matte. I want to get it too. This one is cute. And it's, oh my god, this color is so pretty. Oh, I love it. It's her first red lipstick, because she was searching for a red lipstick or whatever for a while. That looks good. That looks good with her skin complexion. She's a darker skin complexion. She's like darker than me. She's chocolate. So, <laughs> but that doesn't have to do it. She just sticks a lot of stuff that's left on her. But I, I don't know. 
um, it's just so about what you want to wear, what you feel comfortable. And then she got this, um, this blush, and this is Ambering Rose, and I really like it, and I shall be using it. It's like an orangey hint. Like, it looks orange. Kind of reminds me of that NARS one. I don't know what it's called, but yeah. That's what she got. And she got a concealer for under her eye. So, yeah. Oh, and I forgot to show you. I got this Fix and Lavender. It's part of one of the recent collections it came out with. I've never tried the regular Fix, but this one is amazing. Like, oh my god. This is so amazing. Like, already. Okay, first of all, like sprayed on it's like so refreshing and then since it's like fixed lavender it has lavender in it you it's like that lavender scent it's like wafting on your face or whatever and it's like I feel like lavender is so very therapeutic this is so good like I feel so good when I put this on I could put it on in the morning I'm like yay yippee this is good stuff so yeah but I definitely recommend that I want to get another one I hope they're not sold out I feel like spraying some more stuff on, some more of this one. But yeah, that's um part one of my beauty cosmetics haul. Oh my god, I forgot to, I forgot to show something. Whatever, I'll show it in the second part. So um, thanks for watching. Bye.